Now we're going to practice graphing horizontal and vertical lines. So if we start to investigate the line x equals 4, we could make a quick table and plug in some points to see what this graph will look like. Well, what we know is that no matter what y is, x is going to be 4. So that means y could be 0, it could be negative 1, it could be 2, it could be 3, it could be any number. Let's say negative 2 and 1. So if we plot these six points, we should get an idea of what the line x equals 4 looks like. So 4, 0, 4, negative 1, 4, 2, 4, 3, 4, negative 2, 4, 1. We can see that this is creating a vertical line. And that is not a function by the vertical line test. And we know that its slope is undefined. So let's quickly graph the second one without making a table. We want all points where x is negative 1. Well, x is negative 1 here, 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 right? x is negative 1 all the way up and down this vertical line. So here is our vertical line, x equals negative 1.